Hi guys, so today I am actually gonna show you guys how to build this little bath table thing and I have wanted one of these for so long and unfortunately I did not build it for us because we are currently in Utah. So I actually built it for my parents and it's awesome because I always take baths and when I do I always play on like my iPad or read a book or something and I always wish there was like somewhere I could set things. So I made this for my parents and I'm so excited because when I go home I'm gonna make one for me too. But it was cool because we were at my cabin and I was like, what's something we could do here? Because my parents build stuff up there all the time. So like they have tons of wood and I was like, let's do one out of all like pallet wood. So we got this awesome pallet wood that when you sanded it down, it's really pretty. And then we have these legs that were actually from an old side table that were in one of our cabins up there. And we combined it all and we made this cool little table. So let's get into it. Okay, for this DIY, you're going to need three 1x4s, a circular saw, some brad nails that are about an inch and a quarter, a hammer, a measuring tape, a sander with two grits, and two 2x3s. So what I'm doing here is I'm just measuring from end to end on the outside of the bathtub, and then my next measurement will be end to end on the inside of the bathtub. Now take that first set of measurements and mine was about 34 inches and I'm just making a mark on all three pieces of my wood so I can cut them. Now make that cut on all three pieces of wood. and space them how you want and then decide which piece you want up and what's going to be showing. Then take your 2x3 and I put one side all the way to the edge and then just marked where the rest of it ended. Uh, mark that same spot on both pieces of wood and make those two cuts. Place your 2x3s the same distance apart as the inner measurement of your bathtub. So in my case it was about 16 and a half, so I just placed it at 16 to give myself a little wiggle room. Then I put my 1x4 on top and I'm just measuring on both sides to make sure that it's evenly placed and then I'm going to start nailing it in. piece should look like once you have everything nailed together and we're gonna start sanding. So I always have two grids of sandpaper, one pretty high and one pretty low so I can soften out everything. So I just started sanding with my lowest grit which is the grittier more rocky type of sandpaper. switch to your higher grit sandpaper which should feel a lot smoother and I'm just getting all the little edges here to get all the little slivers and make sure everything's smooth so when you touch it it feels nice. And now just place it in your bathtub and it should pop right in and it now works as a table. Okay guys, that's it. It is so easy, so simple, and I love it so much. 
and I want one so bad. I thought it turned out really pretty and my parents are very excited about it. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more of my DIYs, subscribe down below. And when we hit a thousand, we actually are doing a giveaway. You can go check out that video. It'll be linked down below as well. And I'll see you guys next week. Bye.